office was challenged by the Wright Pierce Andover office to do the ALS ice bucket challenge in a sustainable way. So we decided to also challenge the Mattabasa district in, in Nickerson to participate in this challenge. And, and what better way to raise the bar than by using effluent from a wastewater treatment plant to do one up on the Andover crew that use swimming pool water. And what better effluent is there to use than the effluent from the Mattabasset District? And so we're standing right now between the two new secondary clarifiers that were recently constructed as part of an ongoing $100 million upgrade. This treatment plant represents a significant investment by the sewer users and the state of Connecticut um, in enhancing and protecting the water quality of the Connecticut River and Long Island Sound and all the people that use both of these natural resources benefit from this investment. And standing next to me, I have Brian Armet, the Executive Director from the Mattabasset District who's responsible, who owns and operates and maintains this treatment facility. And on this side, we have John Miller from C.H. Nickerson, the President, when they're responsible for the construction of this upgrade project. We were challenged by the Andover office of Wright Pierce, um, also some of our friends over at Weston and Sampson, and I was personally challenged by a friend of mine, Dave Laird, who's a foreman over at Amtrak. So with that, I'd like to acknowledge all of them and the I'm the designee for the Bright Pierce office in Middletown, and we are challenging actually our Portland, Maine office to do the ALS challenge. And I'll let Brian say who challenged him and who he plans to challenge. I was challenged by the Middletown Wright Pierce office, and I challenged Richard Barlow, the first elected of Connecticut, Vincent Susco, the administrator for the East Hampton Colchester Wastewater Treatment Facility, and Jay Jean of Woodward and Carl. I was challenged by, the, by these two guys, uh, plus uh, Jackie Lauer in our office, whose sister suffered from ALS. Um, and I'm challenging Stan Bajoff, who's going to dunk me. We'll take care of that today. Mike Roy, Mike Roy uh, and um, Dan Radacy in our jobs in, in, in Hartford and New Haven. So, hey guys. with that, keep your mouth shut. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I guess it's time for us to go take a shower now. Thank you all for coming. <laughs>